don't know if you can be seen down there, but hello, hi. <laughs> so today we've decided to do a kind of sibling tag because we are not, we're not siblings, we're cousins, but we have grown up together just as siblings would. I saw you at least once a week. We had Friday at tea least. time. Friday tea time. Friday tea time every single week. So we thought today we would answer some sibling tag questions and hopefully they'll relate quite well to being cousins. These questions are stupid. <laughs> Was the first list of questions, where did you meet? We're no. cousins. List of cousin tag questions. How and when did you meet? Well, the day I got pushed out of my mum's vagina, pretty much. And was, you know, we're cousins. I don't think I was there for that. So, I mean, it was probably like a good... Day after. I'm pretty yeah. sure that your dad... That's all we A fun story. My dad didn't take me home from the hospital. Did you know that? Because there was a child in game on. His first born child he did not take home from the hospital. Your dad had to come and pick me up. Amazing. I no! It's a good story. That's a bad story! How and when did you meet? Or well, we just discussed this. Yeah, like, when I was yay high. About this big, and I was fat. I don't even know how much I weighed when I was I was fat, I was 10 pounds. I, I was a little baby. I was more huge. Than, more than bigger than I was. Yeah, they used to call me the Michelin Man because I had so many rolls <laughs> in my legs. Like a load of car tires. Just like oh, I was so fat when I was born. Um, how are you related to your cousin? Well, we're cousins. What kind of a stupid question is that? Our mothers are twins. Twinnies. So I guess that's what it means. We're just cousins, that's all it is. Describe each other in three words. You go first. Arrogant. No, <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, it's true. Artistic. <laughs> Pardon? Artistic. Oh, it's an autistic. Not autistic, artistic. Right. Well spoken, if that's one word. You're very well spoken. Well, that's two words. Well, it's got like a hyphen. Well spoken. One word. Favourite. A. Hey. Three words about me. Try not to be offensive. Oh. <laughs> okay. Outgoing. Mm hmm. You're also very artistic, just not in the same way as I am. Very true. You do like theatre and music, whereas I do conventional Arty art. Stuff. Nutty. Nutty. You're a little bit balmy. I am a little bit balmy. I would I go think, with that. I think balmy is probably the... Balmy. I would go with that. What do you think my dream job is then? Your dream job, I reckon, would be to be a graphic designer, but I don't really know in what kind of context, whether you'd want to do it for like a massive company, like one particular company, or whether you'd be like freelance. Maybe just like a freelance, popular graphic designer, where people hire you all the time to do graphics for them. That would be pretty cool, I don't know if it's my dream job. Well, that's just that's just like a real... Well, no, I know, but that's the whole point of this question. The whole point of these <laughs> questions is that, um, I don't know what my dream job would be. Okay. Your dream job? Mm. You'd like to be a stage actor? Would you voice acting, maybe? I would love to do voice acting. I reckon voice acting would be a pretty good one for you. I don't think I'd be too bad at it, either. No. You do a lot of weird and wonderful acting. I do. I say wonderful, just weird, mostly. You do that much from Togo when you do that. Brilliant. Brilliant. Next question. Dun, dun, dun. What is something that annoys you about one another? You're kind of mean to your mum a bit, and I'm like, Ross, you've got to stop that. Yeah. She gave birth to you. She did give birth to me. So then, you very annoying. She is, just like all mums. But that's that's pretty much it. And you don't, it doesn't get on my nerves that much, otherwise I'd be like, <laughs> smacking you about that. But just occasionally I'm like, Ross, come on. Don't, come on. Don't get me wrong. I love my mum. But? She does do a lot for me. But she's very annoying sometimes. It's only like 5% of the time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And there's not much that annoys me about you. Otherwise we wouldn't hang out all the time, so. Yeah. What about me? What annoys you about me? Hard to pinpoint one thing. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're always very stubborn. Yeah. Like once you get an idea in your head. I will not. That's what it is. And yeah. you won't back down. And I think that annoys me because I'm also... Quite similar. It takes longer to get ready. Well, I'd say about 30 seconds to get ready, so... Yeah, I'd say me. Just because I'm a female. Yeah. Not to be sexist or anything, I mean, some men might take a while, some women might not take a while, but... Yeah. you got this to... i got this to do, the pink hair and the face. It's all my makeup. All the makeups. Next question! What was the last thing you bought for one another? Jesus Christ. Um... I would have thought it would be some kind of food, because we don't really... Yeah. ...buy stuff for each other that often. I would have just thought it'd be... Dinner. I'd probably bought you dinner at some point. Exactly. Probably food. Well, I drive all the time, so petrol yeah. is technically yeah. my yeah. gift to you. Love some petrol. Thanks. Basically, we don't buy each other gifts because we're lousy, lousy relatives. Lousy relatives. No, we're sassy independent relatives who don't need no man or woman to buy other stuff for them. Just buy it yourself. 
Exactly. Is that right? Sweet elbow action. What is one thing that you can do that your cousin can't do? Put my leg on my shoulder. I'm pretty sure you can't do that. Done this in a video before, I'm sorry. Go on. I can't put your leg on my shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> I did it! No, not my leg, your leg. Uh fuck it. You're right. I know, I know. Hang on. I'm determined. <coughs> How about can you just pull this get that? No, it's not happening. That's a no. Pee standing up. You can't do that. I can't do that. Well I could actually. I could give it a go if I stood like over. Yeah, the maybe toilet. maybe don't. Do you have any nicknames for one another? Well you were just called Roscoe growing up. Wash. A wash. Yeah, I couldn't say Ross when I was a child, so I called him Wash. 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 And I didn't have any name for you because... Ham is quite an easy name to say. Ham is, yeah. And then, 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 then. Pesky. Pesky. Pesky Pixie. Pesky Noi. Imabulous. Complete the statement. My cousin is... A wank. A wank? No. Um, my cousin is... One of my best friends. Oh, that's a high precedent. It's cute though. My cousin is fucking annoying. That, that as well. My cousin, you're basically my sibling at this point. Yeah. Yeah. Sister, I never had. Oh, That's cute. Yeah. <laughs> what do you and your cousins have in common? Well, as we both said, we can be both quite stubborn. Which is not a good thing, I guess, but... Well, we never really get into arguments, so our stubbornness doesn't really come into play with each other, no. which is good. Get into lots of arguments with other members of the family. Yeah, me too. <laughs> but not. But not. That's something we have in common. We're not arguing with the other members of our family. Yeah, especially our mums. I'd say you fight with your mum, and I fight with my mum. I don't really fight with mum. I just make kind of like mean underhand comments. comments. Yeah, yeah, you do. They, well, I don't do that. She does it back to me, so she does. It swings around about. Yeah, exactly. It's a love, love, hate, hate. Yeah, you both you both have a different relationship to me Do and my mum. Mum and I pick at each other. Yeah, we don't argue. Like yeah. we don't have argue, we just bicker. Like yeah. it's just like meaningless. Whereas like, me and my mum will be best friends for like weeks and weeks and weeks and then we'll have one day where she will just go absolutely mental at me for something I've said or done and then we just won't talk for like a two for two, three days. Maybe you shouldn't say and do things. Well, okay. Maybe you should bicker with your mum then. Yeah. It's not gonna happen though. <laughs> Who's the oldest? Who's the youngest? You are the oldest by seven months? March, April, May, June, July, August, September. Seven, seven months. I think seven months Woo! and ten days or something. I'm the oldest. You are the oldest. the oldest. And you're also a year above me at school. School, yeah. Right. Yeah, because I was born one side of the summer and you were born just on the other side of the summer. Yeah, if I'd been born like a month earlier, we'd be in the same school year. But yeah. Never mind. <laughs> Who's most likely to succeed? Oh, well it depends what your idea of success is though. Oh, fuck it, I get a philosophy. Well it's true. No, it is true. Because uh, my know. idea of success uh, is, are you happy in life? That's it, that's what life is about. My idea of success is love for money. Exactly, so we have different ideas of success. I don't think it's something that's comparable because mm. obviously you have differing opinions of what success is, but also if you're in different like fields, yeah. like if you want to do teaching and whatever, you want to teach, that's what you're doing. No, what you doing? Like history. Whatever the fuck you're doing, it's not going to be the same as what I'm doing. No, exactly. And like, there's no way that you can really put a measure of like success. Uh, yeah, like, against each other. You can measure like seniority within your field. Yeah. You can't measure success. <laughs> success. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much for watching this cousin tag. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any further questions, do leave them in the comment box. But have that. Have that. And any further ideas that you'd like to see, do let me know. But other than that. Thank you for watching, and I shall see you next week. Bye! Say bye. Say bye. Bye!